This is an introduction to the pen tool in Adobe Illustrator. First, I'm just going to talk about key definitions of some of the elements of the pen tool and how paths and shapes are created in Illustrator. All the shapes are made up of paths. So this is called a path. Whatever outlines your shape is a path. So whether it's a rectangle or an ellipse, they are outlined with a path. A path is made up of line segments that are connected by anchor points. So every corner here is an anchor point, and between the two anchor points is a line segment. A rectangle is made up of straight line segments, and oval is made up of curved line segments that are also connected with anchor points. The one extra element that a curved line segment has are these direction handles. These are meant for editing the curved line segment. If you click and drag one of these direction handles, you could see that the curves are edited by doing that. You could make these direction handles longer or shorter and you could change the angle and that's what dictates what the curve will look like. The very first thing you want to do before you start using the pen tool in Adobe Illustrator, go to Illustrator Preferences and select Selection and Anchor Display and make sure that the Enable Rubber Band for Pen Tool and Curvature Tool are both unchecked. The default usually is that they're both checked so I want you to make sure that they are not checked and click OK. To create a shape using the pen tool with straight lines, you just click to create the first anchor point, move to another spot, click to create the next anchor point, and that will create a line segment between those two anchor points. And then you keep clicking on the next spot where you want your shape to be. Eventually come to the beginning and click on the original anchor point to make sure that you have a closed path. To create a shape with curved line segments, you click and drag to create a direction handle. Go to the next spot where you want to place the next anchor point and click and drag to create the next direction handle. And then you go to the next spot and click and drag so the difference between creating a path with curved line segments or straight line segments, when you create a path with curved line segments, you click and drag because you need those direction handles. And when you create a path with straight lines, you just click, 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 no dragging, just clicking to create anchor points to create straight lines, no dragging, to create a curve, click and drag, click and drag. 